Secure Energy has really taken a leadership role for the past three years in trying to handle waste properly to make sure that the public and the environment are, are absolutely protected in every regard. When it comes to, to wastes that are produced specifically in the oil field, the state's intentions are to regulate what they call T-norm, technologically enhanced naturally occurring radioactive material. Where, where man has interjected with a process of some kind, whether it's filtering or whether it's running things through pipes, when those, when those elements, those naturally occurring elements become trapped and concentrated, now we've got a special waste stream that we need to, to put some diligence around in terms of how we manage and then dispose of it. State regulators have done a very good job in implementing some, some rules in recent history, starting June 1st, 2014, they required waterproof containment. You have to have a watertight container at every saltwater disposal in the state. Those watertight containers are designed specifically to capture filter socks after they've been used. And then uh, the state is also interested in making sure that the transport of these filter socks and other impacted materials are only done by licensed contractors in the state. But again, we would consider the special waste stream managed properly. It poses no risk uh, to the public in the same way as medical waste or oil field waste of other varieties. Take each waste stream and manage it in the right way and there's no risk to the public.